Hey what's up guys in this video we are going to talk about enum in C++ programming. The enum is a user defined data type and the enum consists of integral constant. And the enum keyword is used to create one enumerated data type. And the syntax is first you have the enum keyword then the enum type name and then inside the curly braces we have the member of that enum. Like in example we can create one enum days and inside the curly braces we can have the days of the week and by doing so the first member will have the integral constant as 0 and the second member will have the constant as 1 and this way the constant value will keep increasing up to the end. So to create one enum first you have the enum keyword then the name of the enum like this and inside the curly braces we pass days of the week like Sunday, Monday, Tuesday and so on. And at the end we have to put one semicolon. And this way we can create one enum day and the members will have the constant value and this way all the members will have the constant values. Now inside the main method we can create one days type variable d and which can have one of the member values like we can assign the member Sunday and then we can print the value of D and if we just save and run the program it has printed the value 0 because the first member of the enum has the value 0 that's why it has printed the value 0 and similarly we can assign some default value to the enum members like we can assign the value 1 so because we have changed the default value of the Sunday to 1 so all of these member will have the new constant value and the counting will start from 1. So this time the Saturday will have the value 7. So if we just save and run the program you can see the new value 7 has been printed. And this way we can assign random value to all of those member and if we just save and run the program you can see the program just works fine and printed the new value of Saturday which is 8. So this way we can create one enumerated data type and we can assign default value to all of the enum members. So hope you understand the concept. We'll see you in the next one. Thank you.